No, it should be a good game. Uh, Craig's obviously made a lot of changes over the summer. He's got he's got a big strong team in place. Uh, I watched them last week at Dunfermline. It was a tough game for them. I thought they handled it well. Dunfermline were good, uh, but Hearts handled it well. Restricted Dunfermline to very few chances and and got the win to progress in the cup. So Craig will be pleased with that as well. Uh, There'll be a challenge, but one that we look forward to. Well, it's still early in the season. Everybody, I think, still try to find their feet a little bit. It's, 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 I think it's too early to get carried away with a couple of wins, and it's probably too early to get carried away with a couple of defeats. So we're all looking to see where we where we think we're going to pitch pitch up in the league. Uh, Hearts will definitely be a contender for a top six place. There's no doubt about that, uh, and hopefully we will be too. Yeah, good. Obviously disappointed to to go out the competition. But as I said after the game, we, we competed well. We were in the game from the first minute to the last minute. There were key moments in the game that, that probably went the way of Rangers and, and sometimes that can, that can decide the match. Uh, I think the, the opening exchanges, we probably had the better. Although they'll claim that they had a goal that was over the line, which was early on. Uh, we had a couple of good opportunities as well, and the goalkeeper made one great save for Chris Burt, free kick. And I, I just feel that last week, if we'd got ourselves in front, it would have been a different story. First of all, I think the the most important thing to say is that we're all disappointed that when any player gets a serious injury on any surface, not just artificial, they get injured on grass pitches. For Jamie, we wish him a speedy recovery and hope he's back playing. Uh, make him a speedy and full recovery and hope he's back playing as soon as possible. That's that's, that's the most important thing out of the whole incident. I think for Kilmarnock, the the initial decision to put down that pitch was was financial, and it's benefited the club financially because it's on a much more secure financial footing now than it was ten years ago when it almost went bankrupt. So the benefits are there. For us, we can't lift the plastic pitch this year, so. There's no point in getting into a discussion about it because it can't come up. It's there for the season. We have to play on it, train on it, work on it, and that's what we'll do. He's uh, back training in the squad, Stuart, this week. So, fit to train, fit to play is probably a different story. So, we'll, we'll see how he is today and then make a decision. But he's back in the squad and looking okay.